In this tutorial, you will learn how to set up a quick cloud CDN for a site hosted by GoDaddy. Before we begin, you will need the following. The Lightspeed Cache plugin for WordPress, installed, activated, and configured, and a GoDaddy web hosting account. If you don't currently have the LS Cache plugin installed, you can get started quickly and easily with one of our preset configurations. See the video description for more information about that. There are five steps to setting up quick cloud CDN and DNS for a GoDaddy site. First, make sure GoDaddy's own CDN is disabled. Second, you'll initiate auto CDN setup in the Lightspeed Cache WordPress plugin. Third, point your NS records to quick.cloud. Fourth, you'll complete the setup in the Lightspeed Cache plugin. And finally, fifth, you'll verify that all of your DNS records were imported to quick.cloud. Now let's get started. Disable GoDaddy CDN. Log into your GoDaddy account and navigate to My Account, then Hosting in WordPress. Click the menu icon on the Actions tab and click Settings. Verify that the CDN switch is set to Disabled and click OK. Now you can begin to set up Quick Cloud CDN. Log into your WordPress dashboard and navigate to Lightspeed Cache, then CDN, then Quick Cloud CDN Setup. Click the Link to Quick Cloud button. This will open up the my.quick.cloud user account registration page. You can either register using your existing Google, Facebook, or Twitter account, or you can register with your email address. Return to the Lightspeed Cache plugin and click the Run CDN Setup button. When the initial setup phase is complete, you will receive an email with the subject CDN Setup Success with instructions for updating your name servers. Point name servers to Quick Cloud. You will need to log into your domain registrar for this step. Your domain registrar may be the same name as your hosting provider, but that is not always the case. We're going to assume that you registered your domain with GoDaddy, but if this is not true for you, please adapt these instructions to your own domain registrar's interface. To update your name servers, navigate to My Account, then Quick Links, then Domains. Select your domain in the Domain Portfolio and click More. Click Edit Name Servers and I'll use my own name servers. QuickCloud has provided two name servers for you. You can find them in the confirmation email we mentioned previously, or on the Lightspeed plugin's Auto CDN Setup tab. Change the existing Name Server 1 and Name Server 2 fields to the QuickCloud name servers. If there are any other Name Server fields populated, clear them. Click Save and then Continue to apply the changes. Complete Auto CDN Setup. Return to the Lightspeed Cache plugin and click the Refresh CDN Setup Status button. The update process can take some time, but once it's complete, you will see the account is linked status, and the CDN setup status will be done. You will also receive a CDN now enabled email confirmation. While you're waiting, you can use dnschecker.org to see whether the QuickCloud name servers have propagated for your domain. Log into your QuickCloud dashboard, and you will see your domain listed on the My Domains tab. You can click your domain name to review the services overview for the CDN and all of the WordPress optimization online services. At this point, QuickCloud CDN is set up and ready to go, but it's a good idea to verify that all of your DNS records have been properly migrated over from GoDaddy. Navigate to DNS Zones, select your domain name, and look at the DNS records that QuickCloud has detected. Go back to your GoDaddy account and navigate to My Account, then Domains. Select your domain name, click DNS, and Manage Zones. View your DNS records and verify that they are the same as those detected by QuickCloud. If any necessary GoDaddy DNS records are missing in QuickCloud, you can use our new tool to import them. Here's how. Click the menu icon on the right and click Export Zone File. This will download a text file with a bind configuration for your DNS records. Back in the QuickCloud DNS Zones area under the Tools button, select Import DNS Records. Click the Browse button to select the text file that you downloaded from GoDaddy and click Import. QuickCloud will add any missing DNS records it finds in the import file, but will not replace or update any records that already exist in your DNS zone. Congratulations, you have successfully set up QuickCloud CDN and QuickCloud DNS for your GoDaddy hosted WordPress site. If you have any questions about anything you've seen in this video, take a look at the links in the description. For more on this and other QuickCloud topics, please see our documentation at quick.cloud slash docs. Thank you for watching, liking, subscribing, and sharing. See you next time!